So we've got some good news. Uh, you guys all know about the Ed Markey versus Joe Kennedy Senate race. Joe Kennedy is challenging incumbent Ed Markey in the Senate. Massachusetts is holding its primary on September 1st, so we're just about like four or five days out at this point. And three Massachusetts Senate polls have come out. So Suffolk University has Markey plus 10. Data Progress has Markey plus 7. And UMass Lowell has Markey up 12 points. And if you average all those out, it has Markey up 9.7. So this is really good news because Ed Markey's seat uh, is very important to hold. He's a Green New Deal supporter with AOC. AOC has been a pretty unabashed supporter of his this whole time. And more importantly, Joe Kennedy is extremely corporate. He's very milk toast, and he's a really, really big sellout. He's not for things like Medicare for All. He is Nancy Pelosi. So much so that she decided to endorse Joe Kennedy over sitting Senator Ed Markey. Now, this is not something that means you should get complacent and not, you know, vote or be enthusiastic or donate to him or anything like that. It's important to make sure to do all of those things to finish out this victory. Um, I'm also hopeful that hopefully Nancy Pelosi's endorsement of Joe Kennedy will actually be sort of a Uno reverse card move, sort of like Hillary Clinton's endorsement of Elliot Engel was. How that was kind of the kiss of death for his campaign. But this is really good news. We got really good numbers here on Ed Markey's race. Now we got to look at Alex Morris versus Richard Neal in Massachusetts 1st District to see what kind of uh, results we get there. Hopefully we can pull that one off. That one's going to come pretty razor thin. Uh, but, you know, we will hold out hope. So, you know, really, I would say it's even, you know, considering the state of the race, I would say that supporting Alex Morse right now is actually takes precedence over Ed Markey because, as you can see, Ed Markey is pretty much demolishing his opponent. And I don't really see how Joe Kennedy could win. Could some sort of freak uh, incident happen or some result or something like that? Yeah, sure. But it just seems unlikely to me. So there's some good news. We got good numbers for Ed Markey. We really need to hold the seat. Uh, but man, he is, he is demolishing right now.